here we are in the Moss Deep City Gym again. And what I totally forgot to do in the last episode, which was kind of a no brainer, which remember way back when when I said I'd evolve my Leaf Blade finally at level 40? Well, now you're gonna see it finally evolve. Yes, and I think this is, again, uh, my last Pokemon that's gonna actually reach its final evolution. You know? And I've been waiting so long for this moment to happen, and now it's finally happening. And I know you guys have probably been patient to see my Leaf Blade finally evolving, so it's now a Sift Tree. You know, and I, I really like Sift Tree. He's like one of my favorite grass type Pokemon in the whole Pokemon generation and stuff. And I have my, um, Swamp Bird and my, um, Leaf Blade up to, or my, um, newly evolved Sift Tree, I should say, up to the front, if you hadn't noticed already. And I'll show you how to get through this, um, gym. It's pretty straightforward, you know, this puzzle isn't too hard. And I already messed it up. Okay, I gotta quit doing that. Oh well. Um, go, hit, simply hit that switch to make that arrow go up, which is in the right direction. Then do the whole puzzle that now you're going down here. Slide on this, um, set of arrows, hit this switch so it goes right in the right direction. Um... Then we can slide on this part of the arrows, and then we can do our full set of arrows. Slide again for the second time in a row, and then we can come over here, hit this switch right here. Oh, and I forgot, oh man, I forgot an important switch, so I'm gonna have to fix that right here now. Uh, it's back here, and it's gone, this set of arrows, and hit this switch. Now that battle right here is optional. Same with that battle right there. If you don't, if you can just hit this switch. Other than that, the, the, those are like the two uh, trainer battles I think that are optional in this gym. You know, but you know it's just four switches. You have to switch in the right direction. It's not too tough. In my opinion, it's like one of the easiest gym puzzles. But um, that last one right there kind of stumped me, but I realized it really quickly. But then after all that's done, um. We can battle Tit and Wiser because they're twins and, you know, we gotta do a double battle with them. But I strongly recommend you save, you know. And then we are gonna battle the twins, Tit and Wiser. And then they, like, say like, the same things at the same time because they can sense the other one, um, what the other person is saying all in their minds, you know. Yeah, they're, like, saying one part of their lines and then the other one says the other part of their lines. Like, Take this one for a second. This combination of those, can you beat it? Yeah, I always like what they what they can do. It's I thought it's like always neat, you know. So he just taking Eliza. We gotta go and double battle with him, and this is the only double battle um, that you get with a gym leader, which I think that was pretty cool of the um, gym, um, of the game creators to do. Um, there's my new spider, my sister there. Um, they have their Lunatone and the Soul Rock, and they can do awesome combinations, by the way. Um, the Soul Rock knows Psychic, Sunny Day, Flamethrower, and Solar Beam, while the Lunatone knows Psychic, Hypnosis, Light Screen, and Calm Mind. Um, I'd say, um, the, the Soul Rock's more of a threat, because the Lunatone's just a little irritating, you know? So, if, um, the Soul Rock is uh, friendly enough to use Okay, oh no, that is not good, because I know the Soul Rock knows Flamethrower, which is bad against, um, my Leap Blade here, and then it knows also Solar Beam. Oh no, I'm in trouble for sending that Swamp, because that will do high damage on me, and I fell asleep, wow. Oh my goodness. Um, uh, I'm gonna switch out before I like, die, so, just to let you know. Um, and then I'm gonna use Leaf Blade's turn to use my Blue Fruit. That's what I love about my, my Blue Fruit. You know, it always heals up. Um, so it's just like in the Pokemon Fruit that you got from the guy in Lavender Town in the first generation. But enough about the first first generation. Um, the Lunatones Calm Mind can raise up its special attack. Yeah, it's because it, it was gonna use Solar Beam on. Um, yeah. This guy used Solar Beam on Swamp. It's a good thing I switched. Um, and it also knows Reflect, which raises up their defense, so that can be irritating. Uh, um, I'm just gonna probably have to sacrifice Explosion here. Um, I can actually try to use the, um, Solar Beam on the Solar Rock. 
And then the um, it also knows psychic hip and hypnosis. Hypnosis is also irritating, which puts me to sleep and stuff. Ouch, that psychic girl hurt. Oh well, you know, explosion wasn't really out there that I get any action at all. You know, it was just a decoy, I should say. Oh yeah, ooh, it's actually. Oh, did it use Sunny Day? I wasn't actually paying attention. It probably would have used Sunny Day you now. So that's good. I'll uh, make my um show be more take one turn, so that's why I won't hurt itself. And thank goodness the um so locks down and you know it's out of the way. Yeah, and it's my replay grade like forty one. And yeah, my replay is four levels from the level two, level thirty seven is my swamper to my 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 natural you know, because I level thirty seven is my second highest level Pokemon. Okay, it's still a good thing the sunlight's still strong. So I think we can finish it up on this turn. So yeah. But you you just gotta watch out for this, these gym leaders, you know, because it's a double battle and they can do awesome combinations like um the solar beam and the sunny day combination, you know. Plus the um the sun raises up its attack um flame to own attack, you know. So you just gotta watch out for that. But other than that, if you're well trained like me and you know the awesome moves like surf that hit everyone on the field. I think, except for Replay, but I don't know why it didn't hurt Replay, too. But, oh well. Maybe that's only in, like, the fourth generation or something. But, you know, we got our mind bags, and that's, like, all that matters right now. Yeah. And then they'll give you TMO for Calm Mind, which raises up its special attack and its special defense. I forgot to mention this, but it raises also up the special attack. Stats. You know, I thought it, I almost um, thought it only raised up its special attack, you know, but it also raises up its special defense as well. Then talk to the advice giver. What do you say? Wow, it's, you're outstanding. You're one great trainer. Well, he's not gonna like connect it from our gym battle or something. I mean, sheesh. Oh well. We got our badge and we are out of here.